Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. There's no, no such thing as uh, free lunch. <laughs> Sounds like Quenna. That's it. That's gotta be Quenna. Well, Just coming know, ashore. Maybe, maybe Princess Garnet. <laughs> Fresh Cathedral. Oh, sorry. This town too mm, big. Delicious. What all this construction? Mmm. Pickles. Mmm, delicious. <laughs> mm, well. I am hungry. Delicious? You have delicious food? Yeah, they're delicious. Yeah, these pickles taste great. What? That is food? You've never seen a pickle before? No, first time. <laughs> I still need to eat many different food and get much learning. My master tell me so. In that case, you should try one. I think you'll like it. <laughs> okay, I eat. Good for Quinn. Yeah. Finally got himself a good meal. That, that guy made the mistake of actually feeding Quinn. He ain't gonna stop if he likes it. <laughs> uh, wonder if we can get Quinn back in our party. Probably not just yet. <laughs> I'm hoping we can finish Black Sheep in episode 4 of this episode. Alright, so anyway, so we just... Oh, uh, you know what, we're probably going to have to be talking more when we get to the next That's fine, though. People like the story, I assume. Either that, they like watching battles, which... That's a good Who thing. knows? You know? Who knows? So, uh, after, uh... That has set some plan to like get the money from uh, the nerd that they're trying to that's trying to counterfeit money and whatnot. Uh, she oh, here we go. the regent is waiting on board. Please use the ladder to board the ship. Yeah, okay. I was just gonna hop on. <laughs> so uh, after Ada sets up that plan. She, like, calls a whole bunch of people, by the looks of it, to, like, I think mess up the Mafia's plan to, like, go and kill, uh, the nerd. Man, I hope this thing can get us there. Finally, I found you. Huh? Oh, <laughs> here's Quinna. Quinna, what are you doing here? Where are you go, Zidane? I travel everywhere. I'll go over for you. Who's this? Your new girlfriend? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so tired Thank from the dance party. I climb mountains, cross oceans, fight monsters. Wow, you've been through one hell of a trip. So blank. You're coming too? Yeah, I was asked to. By whom? Boss, of course. But I... It wasn't his idea. It was mine. <gasps> We need at least one person to look after the ship when we reach our destination. Frog, frog, plus... I owe you one, guys, for... So I volunteered. You don't owe us anything. He's talking. Okay, anchor the way. Hey, Quinna. Oh, hey, Quinna loves frog, so you'd better watch out. Maybe I eat it? I'm not worried. I've had more enemies as an oddball. Oh, by the way, if you ever want to change your party member, just talk to me. Okay, where are we off to? We're going to the Black Mage Village on the Outer Continent. Alright, press select whenever <laughs> you want to re verify your location. Thanks. <laughs> so who are we taking with? So, where's the select button? I mean, we, we got that. <laughs> Is it on your hat somewhere? <laughs> Well, obviously, Master Fifi. Yep. That's that's a given. Uh, and uh, let's get Red in here, too. You want to take uh, Mikasa? Yeah. It's Mikasa. Why do we still call her Mikasa? She doesn't need the code name anymore. I know. I know. But yeah, you know what? It, it's Mikasa. Yeah, it's Mikasa now. Permanently. All right, that's the team. There we go. The A team. <laughs> Ah, oh, man, Justin, we needed a black guy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Ford. Okay, I think Don't again. forget, Justin. So, where am I going? When, when the mafias were, like, hiring all those people from, like, a bar, 
it kind of looked like they were like fooling around and trying to like uh, you know stall for time by the looks of it I don't know for sure but it it, it seems like it did that way you know yeah um so yeah and then the anime actually ended that like shortly after there right as they were about to uh go and kill the nerd I guess we're done we finished Black Lagoon episode 4 <laughs> well done Justin thanks that didn't really contribute much <laughs> no it's okay uh I'm gonna go around can you go around I hope so anyways uh, since uh, we have spare time we can talk about uh, fairy tale yeah, Fairy Tale episode 176. Yes, the long wait is finally over. Fairy Tale has started back up again. Man, I'm you so glad it. that they got the dragon thing going on now. Yes. Oh my god. And, you know, the next episode is totally going to be about Grand Magic Games. Can't yes. wait for that to finish either. Yeah. It is going to be epic, that last battle. Because I, I believe the battle will be uh, all the like guild members fighting all at once on like a battle royale or something like that. And it is going to be awesome. Yeah, I think so too. You can just, just kind of see that at the end. That they're all coming out. Yeah. Uh, the start of the, the this first episode, it was kind of weird because you didn't know exactly what was going on. Natsu was like, and Lucy were in like a it looked like post-apocalyptic almost because there were yeah, dragons it, everywhere. Like the atmosphere, it was just all red. Yeah, and everything was destroyed. It kind of that kind of threw me off, uh, but you know, I'm sure they'll explain it. So no need to worry. No need to worry. You know? Yeah, it, um, I'm looking forward to it nonetheless. Uh, for yeah. the least. <laughs> of course, they added in a short little uh, introductory. Uh, scene to get those people that haven't seen fairy tale caught up, like based on like you know, you know, with the jokes that they go with or some of the jokes. But uh, other than that, it was a good episode. They introduced it well and uh, had gave you some suspense to look forward to. Yeah, that's for sure. And uh, they. Also got a new theme song. Ooh. This is the AP thing. Yeah. This is good. Oh, yeah, it is. I, I, I will gladly give him more. Sure. I have plenty of it. I uh, will get you that right away. Two things we just got on. <laughs> Time to change equipment? Yep. We'll be right back. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Alright, well, then we're back. Yeah. Uh, so, there was another anime I checked out this week. It's called uh, Blade and Soul. It's actually based off of a game, I'm pretty sure. If anyone's played that game, I have no idea what it, the game is about, anyways. But, uh,. First impressions on, about the anime, like it, the cover, like the picture for it. At first, I thought it was going to be like a big boob anime and whatnot, but it, so far in the first episode, it's not. That's good. It, it's good so far, and the, there was plenty of fighting, which it was pretty awesome. Like the main character, just kind of like first scene where she like uh, she's like fleeing away from people and they like catch up to her and like shoot their guns at her 
the way they did it was so awesome because she just kind of like looked at the bullets and then decided to like dodge them and kill the people. <laughs> it was awesome. Looks like no one's here. Where did they go? I'm gonna go oh, look around. Okay. Careful, Vivi. Vivi, come back. What are you doing? <laughs> Always wandering off. What well, is everyone? They went away with Kuja. Two other guys stayed behind. They're probably at the Chocobo Shack. Why? Why did they go with him? They learned about our lifespan. We can live only for a given amount of time. Kusha said he knew how to extend our lifespan, so everyone followed him. He's lying. I bet he's lying. Look, I know he's... I know he's done... Look, what he's done to us, he's been using us, treating us like puppets. <laughs> Maybe we are just puppets, created to serve humans. What? Come on, that's nonsense. Where'd they go? I can't tell you that. I can't betray them. Then why didn't you go with them? You said the two other guys are in the Chocobo Shack, right? Vivi! Big moments for Vivi. Vivi is always getting emotional. Like that. <laughs> He wants it, to... It's a big deal for you. It, it is, it is. Hello? Is anyone there? Vivi? Please, open the door. Huh? It's born! <laughs> huh? Oh. Wait! Huh? Oh, we made the choke by Red King. And that. <laughs> uh, kind of looks like Woodstock. <laughs> Finally. Finally. Hooray! Hooray! I still can't believe it. Yeah. I don't understand. Why are you here? We're here to look after the Chocobo. At first, we were going to go with everyone. But someone had to stay behind and look after the Chocobo. So we stayed. Oh, we kept the egg nice and warm by putting a lot of hay over it. I can't wait to show him to everyone. They're gonna be so happy. <laughs> we have to come up with a name. Hey, what's happening to me? I feel strange. Me, me too. <laughs> me too. <laughs> <laughs> They're, they're going to stop moving. <laughs> you stayed behind because you were worried about the Chocobo egg. I don't know. I wanted to follow Kuja because I was so scared of dying. But I couldn't. I felt like I was leaving something important behind. Hmm. I'm straight my hat. I want to ask you something. <laughs> What is it? A am I gonna stop pretty soon too? Huh? I don't know. Kuja said the prototype built before us would last longer. But am I gonna stop eventually? I was really confused when my grandpa died. He told me, BV, no need to be sad. So I told myself, I can't be sad. That's why I felt confused again, when I heard that everyone was stopping around here. I didn't know what to do, or what to feel. But when I saw Mikasa crying when her mom died, I wasn't confused anymore. I was sad. If I were just a puppet, I never would have felt that way. Mr. 288, we aren't puppets. I know we aren't. I hate him. I hate Kuja. He's turning everyone into puppets, just to kill people. If it weren't for him, I know everyone would understand someday. It's not fair, BB. Kuja's secret palace 
It's on the eastern side of this continent. Huh? It's buried under quicksand. You will need a ship to get there. Thanks. I hope we can become strong like you someday. But I want that. <laughs> I bet he can even use Debbie. <laughs> He's had so much on his mind. Unlike me. He's fighting so hard. <coughs> I thought I would change after I met Zidane. Once I acceded to the throne, I know I had to change. But nothing has changed. I'm so helpless. Well, Mikasa, are you listening to? That crybaby sure has come a long way, don't you think? Uh, Mikasa? Hmm? Are <laughs> you alright? <laughs> Don't worry too much. She has his own way of dealing with things, and you have yours. Oh, cheers. Well, be good, and you'll get your voice back in no time. <laughs> it's something, huh? <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's get going. Mr. 288 said Kucha's Palace It's buried under quicksand, right? Yeah, we're taking the ship to the eastern side of the continent to get there. <laughs> Just in case you weren't paying attention before. <laughs> and that's what we're going to do in the next episode of Final Fantasy IX. We'll see you then. <laughs>